so friends in this video i'll be sh sharing with you all the fields which are required for process of modification of qf ids so here it is in this finical version earlier what used to happen suppose if a maker has created a qf id so some other user could modify that and some other person could verify the same person was not able to modify any details in the qf id created by the maker so this process has been this problem has been solved in this version of the finical the same officer or employee of the bank can modify qf id if he later on feels that some data has been entered wrongly or it has omitted to enter in the system he can modify this so again he'll type crm here in this here click on this then he'll go to kif retail and edit entity edit entity right so he'll go into this kif retail and edit entity so whatever id is there bank id whatever is there it will be here entity type customer here kif id he'll enter here and place it on submit as soon as he will enter qf id here click on this submit button following screen will appear on your computer so this screen shows select entity cb you have to type it will automatically populate here entity type customer then qf id you have to type this qf id now you don't have to do anything just enter the qf id and click on the submit button here at point number 4 then again next screen will appear on your computer after clicking on submit button following screen will appear here and all the qf id that was entered here all this detail will come here you can see here so shubham is the name of the customer it was account qf id was created in chennai to so all these detail will here so you have to right click on qf id here this is the hyperlink here as soon as you'll with the mouse right click here and enter here with the mouse following screen will appear on your computer so as soon as you will right click on this following screen will appear view new edit or quick edit to so quick edit mein there are certain features very fast you want to change very fast otherwise edit mein all the fields you have to visit again quick edit mein there are certain like suppose you want to change mobile number email ids that can be done right click here if you click on this edit following screen will appear here quick mode demographic details psychographic details other bank details event details transaction financial details trade finance details and basic entries so you can choose accordingly where you want to changes where you want to make the changes when we were creating this qf id all these fields we had filled it up there so we can choose wherever we want to make the changes so as soon as you will right click on that edit entity you will put submit this window screen will pop up on your computer all the details i told you all your general basic information contact details identification and documents details currencies we had entered earlier all these fields will appear here uh, so maker or any officer who is doing this can change this either by drop down or by moving the cursor or any information anything he can do it and finally he has to save those details here here it is not submit all the time it is saving here save is like f4 submit is like f10 so upon saving generals details have been saved successfully click on this okay the all records that you have edited will be saved accordingly so after clicking on like okay the officer who is supposed to verify will verify again the same process that i have shown you in my prior video about this so any modification again has to be verified by another of verifying officer so this is how modification can be done either by the same user or by any other user so this is the how the system works in the finical